Okay, now we'll do part 2 of exercise 12.1. Solve the following equation. The first equation is 17p minus 2 is equal to 49. Okay, now you have to find out the value of p over here. So what you do is, see this is equal to sign and this is minus 2 over here. When it goes on the other side, it becomes plus 2. So we'll write 17p 49 plus 2. So now what has happened is minus 2 has come this side, it has become plus 2. So 17p is equal to 49 plus 2. So 17p is equal to 49 plus 2 is 51. Alright. Now, see uh, you have 17p, here uh, you have uh, 51. Now this is 17 multiplied by p. So when you, uh, when you have to take this, that side, this is multiplied here, there it goes and it becomes divided. So it will be 51 upon... 17 and you have to leave p alone over here so when this goes that side p is equal to 51 upon 17 okay 17 ones are 17 threes are so the value of p is 3 all right sum number 2 now 2m plus 7 is equal to 9 okay now when this is positive this side you take it on the other side it will become negative so what you write is 2m is equal to 9 plus 7 goes that side it becomes minus 7 so 2m 9 minus 7 you get 2 so 2 so m is equal to now you to it's 2 multiply by m so this 2 comes this side becomes divided so when you leave m alone over here and take this 2 over here it becomes 2 divided by 2 so 1 so value of m is 1 so this is the value sum number 4 i'll do now 5 into x minus 3 is equal to 3 into x plus 2. So what you have to do first is, see this is outside, right? The outside the bracket. So first you multiply this 5 with the whole bracket with each term like and 3 with this term. So 5 into x is 5x minus 3 into 5 is 15 is equal to 3 into x is 3x. 3 into 2 is 6. Okay. So the multiplication part is done. Now take the like terms together. So this plus. So plus 3x we'll take it on this side. So this is 5x plus 3x comes on this side becomes minus 3x. And take 15 on the other side because they are like terms. So plus minus 15 goes on the other side crosses this equal to sign it becomes plus 15. And this is already 6. 5 minus 3 is 2x. And this is 15 plus 6 is 21. Alright. 2x is equal to 21. So when you have to leave x alone, this multiplied by 2, this 2 comes here, it becomes divided. So x is equal to 21 upon 2. You can't divide it, leave it as it is and your answer is 21 upon 2. Sum number 5. 9x upon 8 plus 1 is equal to 10. Alright. 9x upon 8 plus 1 is equal to 10. This plus 1 goes on the other side. 9x upon 8 becomes minus 1. So minus 1. So it is 9x upon 8 is equal to 10 minus 1 is 9. This is divided here. It goes over here crosses this equal to sign it becomes multiplied 9x is equal to 9 multiplied by 8 all right 9 8 is at 72 so 9x is equal to 72 now you have multiplied here 9 8 multiplied by x so this 9 which is multiplied comes on this side it becomes divided so x is equal to 72 divided by 9 9 ones are 9 8 za. so the value of x is going to be 8 Explain the sum again. 9x upon 8 plus 1 is equal to 10. So this plus 1 crosses this equal to sign. It becomes minus 1. So 9x upon 8 is equal to 10 minus 1. 10 minus 1 is 9. So 9x, 9x upon 8 is equal to 9. Now 9x is equal to 9 multiplied by 8 because this is divided. It goes on the other side. It becomes multiplied. 
9x is equal to 9 multiplied by 8. So 9x is equal to 72. x is 72 upon 9 because this 9 goes down. So the value of x becomes 8. Begin with sum number 6. We have y upon 7 plus y minus 4 upon 3 is equal to 2. And this is subtraction. This is, sorry, this is addition over here. And in order to add, you need to have equal denominators. So if they are not equal, we'll have to make it equal. Now let's take a number, uh, LCM. Let's take the LCM now 7 and 3. So we have to choose a number which goes in both the tables, like table of 7, table as well as table of 3. So it's number 21, which goes in 3 as well as 7. So what we'll do is we'll take 7 into 3 plus 3 into 7. Same thing we have to do on top. Y multiply by 3 and y minus 4 multiply by 7 is equal to 2. Okay, y multiply by 3 is 3y. Three 7 3s are 21 plus 7 into y is 7y minus 7 into 4 28. 7 3s are 21 is equal to 2. Alright, now we have this 21 21. So 3y plus 7y minus 28 upon 21. All right, is equal to 2. Now, this 21 goes in the other side. It is divided here. That becomes multiplied. 3y plus 7y minus 28 is equal to 2 into 21. 3y plus 7y is 10y. 10y minus 28. 2 into 21 is 42. Now, 10y. This minus 28 goes on the other side and becomes 42 plus 28. Okay. So 42 plus 28, let's do it over here. 42 plus 28, it is 70. So 10y is equal to 70. So y you have to leave alone. This 10 comes down. So therefore, y is equal to 70 upon 10. That is 10 ones are 10 sevens are. Therefore, y is equal to 7 is the answer. Again, I'll tell you what we've done. We've taken the LCM, 7 into 3 and 3 into 7, the same number we've multiplied on top. So, 3y plus 21, here you have 7y minus 28. So, we take 21 common. This 21 is divided. It goes on this side. It becomes multiplied. So, multiplied. 21 into 2 is 42. 3 plus 7, 10. So minus 28 takes take like terms together. It's 42 over here. So minus 10, 28 goes on the other side plus 28. 10y is equal to 70. Y is equal to 70 upon 10. Y is equal to 7. Now let's do sum number 9. I'll write it here. Okay, sum number 9. X minus 9 upon X minus 5 is equal to 5 upon 7. All right. So now here, what do we do? We cross multiply. 7 into this 7 goes here, x minus 9. And 5 into x minus 5. Got it? So now 7 into x is 7x minus 9 7s are 63. 5 into x is 5x minus 5 5s are 25. All right. Now, like terms together, so 7x, this is plus 5x, we'll take it this side, it becomes minus 5x. And this minus 63 goes on the other side, plus 63, this minus 25 remains as it is. So, 7x minus 5x is 2x, and 63 minus 25, if you take out, 20, uh, if you take out 25 from 63, you get 38. So, is equal to 30. 8. x is equal to 38 upon 2. This 2 comes down. 2 ones are 2 ones are 2 nines are. So therefore value of x is 19. Got it? Now sum number 10. y minus 4 upon 3 plus 3y is equal to 4. All right. Now, here there is nothing. So, it is considered as considered as 1. So, it is y minus 4 upon 3 plus 3y upon 1 is equal to 4. We have done this kind of sum before also. Now, we have to 
have a common LCM, common number down. So we multiply this by 3, we'll also have to multiply the numerator by 3 plus 3y, 1 into 3, so this also into 3 is equal to 4. y minus 4 upon 3 plus 9y upon 3 is equal to 4. Now we can take it on a, uh, this you know can be written, these two 3s are there now, we can write it as 1, 3, common we can take it, y minus 4 plus 9y upon 3 is equal to 4, alright. This 3 comes here because divided it becomes multiplied. So y minus 4 plus 9y is equal to 4 into 3. I will continue it here. Alright. Now y minus 4 plus 9y is equal to 4 3s are 12. Now like terms together minus 4 goes on the other side and these two terms remain together. So y plus 9y is equal to 12 plus 4 because this minus 4 has gone on the other side. 9y plus y is 10y, 12 plus 4 is 16. So y is equal to 16 upon 10. Alright, 16 upon 10 means 2 8s are 2 5s. So value of y is 8 upon 5. Alright, that's it.